Hey there, friends. Thanks for checking in. Springfield Armory has made a name for themselves with their Hellcat line. I remember when it was first introduced, it was met with wide approval, a lot of excitement. People wanted to learn more about it. But what we did not know at that time was how many Hellcats would make their way into the line. Now, in this bag, I have the newest Springfield Armory Hellcat. In March, a little over a year ago, in 22, they launched the Hellcat Pro. And this was the most exciting Hellcat launched yet. Outside of the initial introduction of the Hellcat, this was very popular immediately. People said it's a larger Hellcat, and it is. It offers three finger contact, a 15 round flush fitting magazine, a 3.7 inch barrel, optical sight pistol, and a Gen 3 trigger that breaks right at five pounds. A flat face trigger breaks right at five pounds with a very short reset. Everything else is essentially the same as the smaller Hellcats with the three inch barrel. Forward serrations, tritium front dot, U-notch rear sight, adaptive grip texturing, two slot pick rail, overall very well balanced handgun. But now they expanded on the Hellcat Pro line with this model. And here it is. It's a Sports Inc. exclusive. And you can see right away, it has a 4.4 inch threaded barrel, which gives shooters the option to shoot suppressed. And with the additional barrel length, increased accuracy. And that is always a nice touch. So you have the 3.7 inch barrel and the 4.4 inch barrel. So if we take a look, you can see that it's a bit longer, of course, but you do have that option. And I have a We The People holster that I, that I got for the original Hellcat Pro. Fits right in there, no problem. So you could carry with this longer barrel, which I think I mentioned is a Sports Inc. exclusive. They teamed up with Springfield Armory to get this done. It has the same grip texturing, the 15 round magazine, and all the other features that I mentioned with the tritium front dot, U-notch rear sight. Now the optic that I have on here, it ships with the cover plate, is a Swamp Fox Sentinel. You have a direct mount with any footprint of a Shield RMSC, okay? I could have gone with the Shield RMSC, but I went with the Swamp Fox Sentinel green dot, and it was, I think a great choice. I, I've become a Swamp Fox fan, if you will. I currently own three of them. But it has a very nice feel, and I like the OSP models with the optic on there, and I like the additional barrel length. It gives a full-size handgun. In my estimation, anything over four and a quarter inches is full-size, but the handgun's not full-size. The barrel length is. So I took it to the range, performed great. Let's check it out. Before we get these on the scale to see if there's any great weight difference with the longer 4.4 inch threaded barrel, I want to talk about the MSRP. The original Hellcat Pro MSRPs without an optic, two 15 round magazines for $649. The Hellcat Pro with the 4.4 inch threaded barrel has an MSRP, once again, cover plate, two 15 round magazines, $667. So there is not a great difference in cost. But we'll take a look at this. It has the magazine unloaded, 21 ounces even. But if we take that out and put a 15 round mag that is loaded, it's weighing in at 27 and a half ounces at around there, 28 ounces even. That's the original Hellcat Pro. Here we have the threaded barrel model. And that's weighing in at 28 and three quarters. So three quarters of an ounce more is what you're looking at. Now, I don't think that's much. <laughs> if, if you like a longer barrel, I don't think three quarters of an ounce is a big deal. And once again, if it has a 
if your holster has a cutout this wide, it should fit that threaded barrel without issue. You may not have to go out and purchase another holster, but there it is. The newest Hellcat. It's a Hellcat Pro with a 4.4 inch threaded barrel and the Hellcat line continues to expand and you're looking at the latest one. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.